Hey guys, Paul here. I wanted to do a art of four today on um, how I cured my hay fever. Um, and to give you a bit of a backstory, for, I cured it, I think the last hay fever tablet I took was June, May or June 2013. So coming up to four years ago, uh, I used to take, I used to have hay fever pretty much from when I was, I don't know, as long back, as far back as I can remember. Uh, I got Craig on camera and he's, uh, we've been friends since we were like five year old and I think Craig will agree that I've probably had hay fever as long as he's known. Uh, probably certainly as long as I've known you, right? Yeah, yeah. Um, and I used to, I used to play golf, it's an art of four because it was golf that helped me uh, cure me, me hay fever. That I used to play golf, I'd have to take three tablets a day and I've, and I've tablets in my bag. Um, because in case I got halfway round and my hay fever kicked off, I'd have to walk in the woods and I spent a lot of time in the woods as I've just done in the last shot. Um, and I, after learning about golf, eventually I learned that ignorance is not bliss. Knowledge, you need to learn stuff. If you wanted to do something at golf, you'd learn a bad shot happened for a reason. So you'd go through and learn what happened. So eventually after 30 years of having hay fever and being sick of taking paying seven pound a week or whatever I was paying for hay fever tablets. Um, I decided I need to know what hay fever is. And most people, when I talk to them, don't even know what hay fever is. So basically, they, I thought, well, what's the tablet? We'll start with a tablet. The tablet's an antihistamine. So most people will say, well, hay fever's allergic to flowers, pollen, trees, grass. I'm not sure. People have different um, allergies to different stuff. But the pill you take is not an anti-pollen pill. It's an antihistamine pill. So what's a histamine? Histamine is the chemical that you create when you think you're under attack from pollen. Let's just say pollen for now. So all of a sudden you're taking a pill because you're allergic to the chemical you're creating. So you're actually, you're actually allergic to yourself, but it's the, it's the pollen that you think that kicks it off. So the first part to fixing it is understanding that it's an antihistamine pill. So you are you are allergic to the histamine that you create, which is which makes which makes it. Um, oh, I'm saying that you're allergic to yourself. So you have to understand that you're taking a pill for the histamine, not for the pollen, not for the pollen at all. And it's a big part to understand. So go off and search it. Doctors will do it. You know whether they agree or not. They certainly don't tell you. So once you work out that you're allergic to yourself, then you have to deal with, how do I deal with, am I under attack or not? And the simplest thing that I did was every day, I woke up and went, you're not under attack, you're not under attack, that's all I did. But I consciously did it, I don't know, probably for a month. I kept doing it, I'm caught, you're not under attack, you're not under attack. And literally that day, I never took a, a, a pill again. I mean, Craig will tell you, he used to have uh, packets of hay fever pills at his house in case I went went round uh, and I had a, a blast of hay fever um, so they do have to tell you because he, he believed me if he did anyway so what I'm saying is all I did and you may think it's a stupid fix but it worked for me I'm not saying it'll work for you or not but this is all I did I consciously went I'm not under attack I'm not under attack I'm not under attack and I never needed a second hay fever tablet again and I like I said I used to take three a, a, a day to get around a golf course and I was playing golf most days and I play more golf now than I ever did um, and that's all I can say is how I cured my hay fever or some people will say how I manage my hay fever and that's that's maybe what it is or what it's not but you know doctors are not telling you pharmaceutical companies are not telling you because they like you on your seven pound a month habit or week habit whatever it is these days but if you give it a try, uh, I'll give you some links to some more in-depth stuff, but it really is as easy as saying I'm not under attack, but you have to understand why you're not under attack. So leave a comment, let me know what you think, like, dislike, disagree with me, that's fine. Uh, just give me a reaction to what you're thinking. I'm not trying to sell you anything, so I'm just telling you what worked for me. Come visit me, paulnicholson.com. Uh, see you all again soon. Cheers.